that the Lord has made. Yes, it is a wonderful day to have a wonderful and a beautiful day. It's now time for us to read and hear what our devotional on December 26th is going to share with us. And the book, of course, we've been reading all year is God's Big Idea. I'm Auntie Kay, and our devotional title is When Jesus Comes. And our scripture text is Matthew 24 and 13, where it says, He will come with great power and glory. Jesus told the disciples that when he comes back, everyone in the world will know about it. Everyone will see it. It will be big with angels and bright clouds of glory. Everyone will hear it. It will be loud with trumpets and shouting. You won't be able to miss it. The believers who have been waiting and hoping for this day will go up to meet Jesus in the clouds. And in that moment, everything will be changed. In an instant, we will all be changed. The old world will be over. We will no longer think about our old life and its problems. Our new life will begin. <laughs> we will be happy. And not everyone will be happy to see Jesus return. The people who decided they didn't want to follow God's plan will not go to meet Jesus. The Bible says that they will try to hide in caves and behind the rocks on mountains. The people who didn't believe God will be afraid. But Jesus says when these things begin to happen, don't fear. Look up and hold your heads high because the time when God will free you is near. We won't be afraid. We won't try to hide. This is what we have been hoping for. We will hold our heads high. We will meet Jesus in the air. We may wish we knew more about the second coming, but we do know the most important fact, and we will be with the Lord forever. All the rest is details. This is what we've been waiting and hoping for. We will be with Jesus. We will be together. And oh, what a day of rejoicing that will be. Glory to God in the highest. I enjoyed this devotional today from our book, God's Big Idea. Come back tomorrow where we will continue to enjoy and live what we've been learning in our devotional from God's Big Idea.